<sighs> Yikes. All right. So, welcome back. We're just gonna wait a little couple of seconds for some people to join. Post it on Snapchat. Just gonna wait a couple more seconds. So here's what we're going to do. We're just going to take a quick tour of the outside. While we wait for more people to join, we'll take a quick tour of the outside. So this is the very front door. Uh, so now everything on the outside isn't super accurate because uh, of, uh, you know, Minecraft proportions aren't very accurate. But this is the outside. Uh, this is the front door. This is the gym right here. Couldn't finish the road because it wasn't really that important. We got the side entrance where most of the students enter actually through. Uh, I think we're going to enter through, yeah, you know, let's enter through here, right, right here. I don't know. Now nah, let's enter over here. So this is the front door. Eh, you know, no, students enter through over here, so let's enter through here. We'll leave through the other door. So yeah, the office. If I can open these doors, holy crap. All right, so we got the cafeteria. Couldn't add as many tables as there actually are since proportions again. We got the office. I just have some information about how big it is. I started this on April 13th. This is what it looks like on the map. So we'll go to the first room. Uh, these rooms are locked because I've never actually been inside these. I know it's inside this room. It's uh, just like mats and whatnot, but I think this is like an office. So I just put a desk in there. It's, it wasn't that important to me. So first off, we have the choir room. So you get your folders from right here. Uh, you get some instruments out of here, I believe. I've never actually opened those. Got a piano right here. Uh, we got a piano over here. We got the risers, we got a short Lutheran logo, uh, got the projector and whatnot, a little computer stand thing down here, whiteboard. Uh, I don't remember what it says on there, but it's like some kind of big banner thing. Uh, the fire door thing, uh, a bunch of chairs. We got the closet room. 
we got uh, the robes. <laughs> it looks really bad, just trust me. It's the best I can do. All right, we got Miss Siegler's room. Uh, I've never actually been in here. I just know that this is used as a storage room and so there's like uh, some desks and whatnot put in there. We got the light switches, uh, but they don't actually control anything. Um, we got the hand sanitizer, or it could be the pencil sharpener, depending on what you want it to be. Uh, actually, let's go back out this way. Uh, we also have more of these little things in the exit. What the? That's weird. All right, anyways. Um, as you can see, the floor pattern is also accurate. This is what the floor pattern is at the school. I mean, it doesn't look exactly like this, but this is the closest I could get to where it didn't look stupid. All right, we got the courtyard with the cross. I was going to put purple banners on it because there's that purple cloth around it sometimes, but I decided not to ultimately. Uh, we got the little freezer. Uh, these ender chests you'll see all around the map because uh, this is still a server world that I created. So I kind of still got to have these. We got some the vending machines. We got the cow one. We got the snack vending machine and the, one of the drink vending machines. Got the microwaves. <laughs> they're, they're so bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. We got the TV. All the other TVs are decorated though. Um, Miss Wardell's room. Someone said I should put the quote of the day or whatever on it, but I decided not to. Um, now the the bathrooms will be off limits. Be just because, you know, we don't need to see the opposite gender's bathrooms. Uh, but, uh, so I, but in this case, I made them exactly the same so that I could, like, make a, a fake little mirror. But this is the only bathroom that actually is, and it has an interior. <coughs> okay, we got trash bin, recycling. We got Mr. Growth's room. We got that. I should have added a, a map here, but I decided not to, because this game, it's, here, hold on. If we look outside, this map is gigantic, and it would just take up so much, like, more space and make the game so much more laggy if I added more to it. So that's why a lot of this is, like, really, like, low quality. Um, otherwise, the desks would probably be using trap doors for the desks instead, and carpet on top. Anyways, uh, so these are the freshman lockers. I have a couple friends that use these lockers. They got the C Center. Now, I haven't been in the C Center enough to remember if this looks correct. I know the inside of it looks like just about right, but I don't know about the wall. <laughs> All right, we got that corner desk over there too and the little cabinet she has the chargers in. This is, uh. This is Pastor Brug's room. Uh, as everyone might know, Pastor Brug did pass away. So I, I put extra time into making this room, especially for, uh, because he, he, he really did uh, help me out during German especially, and religion, when I was having rough times. Uh, we got the banana sword with the you know, signature on it. <laughs> uh, we got some German flags hanging up. Uh, we got his little colorful window. Is it nighttime? Oh, it is. Hold on. There we go. <laughs> Alright, anyways. We got some more freshman lockers. Oh, C Center. Uh, we got the computer lab. Uh, we got the green screen. I couldn't add as many computers as I wanted to because of limits with the uh, size of the blocks. Got Mr. Gum's room, and I don't remember who else teaches in here. Uh, we got this little window that looks out into the academic commons. Trash bin recycling. Uh, more freshman lockers. We got the two pictures that were recently hung up out outside. Um, we got Mr. Hagedorn's room. Got some Viking stuff over there. Uh, some whiteboards. Um, someone said that this is really accurate. I'm not really sure. I haven't been in his room since like sophomore year. 
more freshman lockers. We got Mrs. Wasser's room. I wanted to add a chicken up there. I might later on. Uh, we got the whiteboards, uh, her shelves, her bookshelves. I just heard a villager. Uh, hold on. This isn't my usual trident. You don't need to be here. All right. Where is my usual trident? Yeah, I'll just keep this with me. All right. Um, Mr. Zandiger. Okay, I, I really put tried to put forth some effort into this room because Mr. Zandig is like my favorite teacher at the moment, uh, as well as Miss Opperman. Uh, we got the podiums. We got this little green thing that says uh, PEMDAS, I think it is. Uh, and then uh, we got the little economics posters or accounting. It's something. I don't know. I think it's uh, entrepreneurship posters. More lockers. We got Mr. Hom's room. You know, maybe it would be more fitting if I had a book on me. Oh, and I, pro I promise this is this is not my personal skin. I uh, for some reason can't get access to my purple s uh, to my uh, actual skin. All right, got his desk. Uh, got the other desk. Projector board, whiteboard smart board whatever you want to call it. more freshman lockers I think these right here are junior lockers or sophomore I think they're junior oh we got this weird board that's over here for some reason I don't remember why or what's on it uh, okay so we got this room I tried to make triangular desks as you can see it did not go very well uh, I probably should have staggered them instead I, like had half of them facing this direction and these ones facing this way but that's a fine, that's fine. I believe earth and space science might be still taught in here. I know personal writing is, because I'm in personal writing. Um, biology room, okay, give me a break. I have not been in here since freshman year, so <laughs> bear with me. Uh, it's the best I can make it look. Uh, I know there's some like posters down here. Again, there's painting restrictions. I don't want to make the game more laggy. We got this back room back here. I've never actually been back here. I just know it's a storage room and that there's an exit right here. Uh, oh, excuse you. Anyways, um, is this activated? Oh, hold on, hold on. There we go. If you were wondering what this is, uh, out here was the, uh, the desert and this was the Cave of Wonders from Aladdin. Uh, and the school was so gigantic that it literally covered up the top of it. So that's why uh, this Cave of Wonders is right next to the school. Let's go back in. Where did I exit from? Oh, right here. That's right. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, we got these little things right here. I, uh, they're just like cupboards or something. Uh, we got these two storage doors right here. Um, okay, I did not make the STEM room. I've never been inside the STEM room, uh, ever. So, let's move on. So, these are this, this is the senior hallway right here. This right here is where, wait, hold on. All right, so this right here is my locker or would be my locker. There's obviously not as many lockers as there should be, but this is where my locker would be. Right here is the bio, uh, well for me, it was freshman biology for first uh, semester. Um, I'm sorry I keep killing these villagers, they shouldn't be here. Um, we got some cupboard things, I don't know. We got these cupboard things. I'm pretty sure they hold books, not whatever I put in here. If I put sea pickles as like fungi, but whatever. We got this little room right here. Uh, I believe my sister's locker would be like right here. Um, we got, okay, so now the courtyard, <laughs> it's covered in snow because uh, I was doing something for my music video, but we got the uh, uh, Luther statue. 
but just like ignore this now. It's it just looks like this because uh, I was doing it was part of my music video. If you're wondering about my music video, I did not finish it because I uh, I couldn't uh, get enough people on board to record with me. Um, we got some more lockers right here. Um, uh, we got the uh, so two storage rooms. Here's the chemistry room. I've never been in, but someone said that the biology of the room looks basically the same. And then so I put these like little um, colorful things so that it would be like the periodic table or something because I'm pretty sure there's a large periodic table in there. My sister's nodding her head. <laughs> um, I didn't put as many desks as there should be because I didn't really think about how big the chemistry room actually was. Um, so I couldn't make enough desks. Also, there were more desks here but uh, in this row, but I got rid of it so I could record a scene for the music video. Uh, which again, if you guys do want to see that music video, please let me know, give me some support, because at one point the second half of the video is all me and villagers, and so, because no one else would want to help, so it was really hard. All right, so, and really difficult, so some support would be uh, nice. So here's the uh, trophy room thing. I don't know. It's got like some kind of things in it. Uh, we got another TV here. Oh yeah, um, there is a T. I'll show you that once we get there. Um, drinking fountains. We got these outside doors. I might build a track, but um, this is the edge of the island that the city's supposed to be on. I haven't made the water yet. Calm down. <laughs> Uh, but this would be the edge of the island, so I was hesitant on putting a track. I might put it back here, maybe. We'll see. I kind of want to add the shed, too. Again, bathroom's locked. Alright, so... Now we're in the... Ju junior... Sophomore hallway? I think... I'm pretty sure this and this is juniors. Alright, so we got, alright, don't judge me, this is Mr. Strasburg's room, um, Caleb Stralo helped me build this room, I've never been in, I've, n ah, no, I was in here for homeroom my freshman year, but I've never actually been in here since then. We got, uh, uh, Amer uh American history, that's right, uh, Mr. Schmidt's room, yeah, Mr. Schmidt's desk and the other extra desk. Uh, it's a little bit dark in here because I think, if I remember correctly, it was usually dark in here. I don't really recall, even though it's literally last year. And I'm pretty sure there was a door in here, but I couldn't remember, so I put it here just in case. So junior lockers, junior lockers. Okay, now I know this room is <laughs> inherently dark. The only light is coming off the smart board. Um, so this is Mr. Groh's room, obviously. Actually, now that I think of it, I think there's a door in here, too. But I don't really want to add it, because then it'll be bright. Um, we got Miss Poplardo's room. I'm pretty sure this is more accurate, except I didn't put... Um, I should have put more banners in here, because my sister and some other people were saying it's a lot more colorful in here. No, I should have put it like a Spanish flag right here or something. Uh, okay, so I know that these are sophomore lockers, but we're going to go down this way now. We got the classic recycling bin and trash bin. Uh, we got the, the uh, junior lockers. We have, So this is, I also believe, is the junior hallway. Hold on, let me set it today. Um, more junior lockers. We got another TV right here. Um... We have the academic commons, which we'll quickly check out. Um, we got this room, which I believe is someone's room. I didn't, I, again, I didn't really think about how big it's supposed to be, because I've never been in there. We got Mrs. Ewer's room. Also, I've never been in here. I've only seen that there's like a big desk in the middle. Uh, oh, my bad. Uh, we have Mr. Gum's room. I think some other people use this sometimes. We got the high desks, a little bit higher than these other ones, these are the circular ones. We got that desk that's in the corner for whatever reason. 
um, we got the mural. I wanted to add a like a white cross in it, but it was too small to add. Uh, we got the Mr. Nolte's r second room or whatever. I had never been back here, so it's just whatever. Mm, actually, you know what? Let's actually light this up really quick. All right. Oh wait, actually no. This is supposed to be a wall right here. My bad. I'm pretty sure. All right, let's put that back. Computer thing where you get the charges from if you need one. Uh, let's go back this way. Got the storage room. We got Mr. Strutz's room and Mr. Dorn's room. We have a map back here. Map of the city. Uh, even though it's supposed to be just a regular map. We got two windows outside. We got the the door to the um, study hall room. This, I think this is freshman and sophomore study hall. But I know that I've seen seniors in here. I even have a study hall in here. So I'm guessing that there's more study halls in here. This is supposed to be like a whiteboard. Because I didn't want to keep placing huge blocks that stuck out from the wall. I've been in here once. And last time I was in here there was just a bunch of crates of books. That I had to carry out to Mr. Kessler's car. So I just left it like that. If we go over here. Uh, what else? Have I shown you everything? Oh, no wait. This is sophomore lockers. This is O's room. Or Ms. Hopperman. So we got some paintings along the walls. We got her whiteboard. We got her little skeleton thing, which is usually in some sort of pose. Uh, this is supposed to be like a, I don't know, like a boom box or something. Uh, it looks more like a toaster, which is what I use for it in other rooms. But I know that there's a, there used to be like an Iron Man mask up here. So I just put like a creeper head. We got some jars of paint. Uh, we got the sinks. Oh, we got the little drawer things, not drawers, um, just slots. We got the slots for people's art stuff. Got the tables, obviously. More charge of paint. We got the kiln room, which is really dark. Now, this would usually lead up to the rafters. If you didn't know that there, that there are rafters, we do have rafters in the school. Uh, I made it so that you can ju actually jump up the rafters, uh, or jump up here, except, uh, there is space up here. There is space for you to walk up around up here. It's not super accurate as it is to the school, but there is space to walk up around up here. So it is sort of accurate in a way. So you know what, because it is, I'm just gonna leave this like this. There we go. No, wait, no, it goes like, eh, eh, there we go. All right, so we got some clay pots and whatnot got a grinder I guess um, we have a uh, this is supposed to be the kiln if you've never been in here and don't know what a kiln is a kiln is uh, something that heats up clay and whatnot so that's hard so it doesn't like deform and whatnot so it basically turns it into like an actual pot uh, uh, we got this room which has I know it has a sink in it it's a storage room so this is, we're still in the art room, by the way, for those of you who weren't aware. Uh, I'm pretty sure all you guys still knew that, though. We got this shelf of whatever. We got some clay wheels, I guess. <laughs> we got the door to the outside. Uh, hmm, let's see. Did I miss anything? I don't think so. All right, so we got this. We got... Uh, we got Pastor Bowers room. I've never, I have never stepped foot in here, as far as I remember. I know that there's a piano in there. Uh, uh, this is currently, um, hmm, I believe it's sophomore and freshman religion or whatever, because the sophomores, half of the sophomores went in here rather than uh, Mr. Growth's room. This is the board for like the, uh, what are they called? Uh, I kept, keep wanting to say transfer students. Um, uh, the students from China and Japan and all that. Uh, it will come to me. Um, 
Oh yeah, this is more sophomore, sophomore, sophomore lockers. Sophomore, sophomore. A uh, bunch of paintings. Uh, we got the art wall. Uh, oh, international, international students. That's right. Okay. Oh, we got. Oh, these lockers are not used for whatever reason. I'm pretty sure there's more lockers right here. I just didn't add them. I think. We got the trash can and whatnot. Got sanitizer. Um, we got the lunchroom. Got some trays. Some soup. Today's lunch is uh, s bread. No soup and uh, sandwich. Soup and sandwich. Oh, with your, ch your choice of sandwich. We got the milk thing. Uh, we have your carrots and veggies. And we got some other junk. I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be more like this. Actually, now that, oh, yikes. There we go, that's better. Alright. Uh, we got the little board that she usually writes something on it. The ladies' lunch they used to. We got the uh, little computer things. We got Mrs. Fink computer. I'm pretty sure this is a popcorn like machine over here. I don't remember. It looks like a popcorn machine, so I just made some kind of little thingy. Hold on, let me put this in my inventory. It's getting annoying. Get that book back. We got this little room. I'm pretty sure it's empty. Yep. Uh, all the storage rooms are empty. And that's why there are these big doors. Because no one really needs to go inside of them. And I've never been in half of them. So. Uh, we have the... C uh, I almost said C-Center. Uh, student services. We got the magazine rack. We got the uh, little waiting chairs. We have this Mr. Dorn's room. I know it's more colorful in here, but I figured no one really cared about this room, so we got the student services desk thing. Uh, so now the office, you cannot get into because uh, when I first created the school, I made it too close to the curb uh, of the city. So if we go out here, it's too close to the curb, so I couldn't add um, I couldn't add the full offices. So there's not even a room in here. I probably could have made the room, but it would have been way too small. So I just decided to block it off, and you could see it from the outside. Figured it wasn't really important to have to go in here anyways. Um, otherwise, it looks semi-accurate besides that dark thing and the bricks behind that window. And I'm pretty sure there's a window right there too, uh, next to Mr. Kessler's door. We got the, one of the teacher tables. Oh yeah, um, we have the big mural and this uh, the Shoreland um, logo. Um, we have the uh, the excellence and uh, service and uh, whatnot. What is it called? Uh, I forget. I should know this too. It's like excellence service. Um, it's something. It's our core. It's our core core values. I forget what they're called. Um, we got the entrance to student services from the back way for the teachers. We got the entrance from the printer room office. Again, it's blocked off because I didn't make that room. We got the teachers lounge. This is supposed to be a toaster this time. I don't know microwave. I guess never really been in here. Only seen it while walking by. We have the food room. We got some stoves. Um, I went with smokers instead of furnaces. I thought it was more fitting since they cook food faster. Got two refrigerators. I've only been in here for intro to psychology, so I don't really remember it. Okay. Now we got the other exit from that room. Got a vending machine right here. So. Ah, oh crap. We got this room. Er that room we got this door <laughs> so this right here is just a book that says like a bunch of stuff like if you're visiting if you're like a random person playing the map and you're visiting that this book's not really for you this is for the store and students just like a reminder that not everything can be super accurate in minecraft but it's as accurate as i could make it coffee shop uh also talks about how uh the seniors, we, w I, w I won't get to see this school ever again, until maybe I go to get my stuff from my locker. And how this is for a lot of us seniors will be the last time we ever see this school, uh, for a long time. 
or at least for a while. Oh, uh, we got this. <laughs> Ooh, okay, we got this thing. I don't remember what's in here, so I just put that thing. Uh, we got the. Oh wait, what? Excuse me. All right, we got this little shelf of clay things. Why is every block missing? Okay, uh, we got the fountain. We have the pictures. Uh, some more pictures. Uh, we have uh, the Caden. No, not Caden Naves. Uh, yeah, Kate. Well, Caden Naves brother, uh, Cameron Nave. We have his jerseys. Uh, Shoreland. Um, oh yeah. Okay, bathrooms are locked. I forgot about that. Uh, I don't remember what that room is. Lunchroom. Oh wait, I thought the lunchroom was blocked. Oh, it is. It is blocked. Lunchroom is blocked. Or like cafe, not the like, cafeteria or lunchroom. The uh, kitchen. Kitchen is locked. We got some pictures. This is supposed to be my galaxy picture that's hanging up in there in the hallway right now. What is this? Oh, okay. This is another room. I don't know what's really in here. Another exit from Pastor Bowers' room. This leads outside. So this is where the, uh, the dumpsters would be over here, and so would the big shed. Uh, as you can see, not everything in the back has been finished because I didn't really think that was super important. I uh, figured I'd take care of it when I needed to. I didn't add this because this connects to the boys' locker room. I didn't add this because it's a girls' locker room. We got the weight room. We'll go in the weight room in a moment. We got this room, which is the gym teacher's like office. Didn't add that. The boys teacher, at least. Well, boys locker room. I'm pretty sure there's some music stuff in here. Now, I don't want to spoil what the gym looks like entirely, so we're going to go back the other way. All right. Girls locker room. Entrance. We got a drinking fountain. Recycling room. Recycling bin and desk thing. We got the teacher's chairs. We got this room that leads upstairs. Excuse me, sir. You shouldn't be here. Okay. You know, maybe let's just have... Uh, I'm just going to have that on ready. Alright, so we have the bleachers. We have this thing up here. We have the, uh, the short and loose enchant. We have the banners of all the schools. We have the, uh, uh, all the different, like, a, uh, what are they, like, achievement things? I don't know what they are. We got another Shoreland Lutheran logo. We have the big mural above the stage. I'm wondering why it wasn't punching. That was weird. Um, we got the little organ room. Now, you can go up onto the stage. However, I did block it off because there's nothing back here yet. Because uh, I didn't think it was super important. Because the curtains are usually closed anyways. Um, we have the two big giant fans. Uh, hold on. We have a basketball right here. Oh, it's supposed to be a basketball. And you can actually dunk it. You step on these pressure plates. You get jump boost for a little bit and you can throw it into the hoppers. Let's get that out of there. There we go. We got the other team, opposing teams, uh, bleachers. We have this little storage room. I didn't make it big enough, obviously. Uh, but I've been in there. I just didn't make it big enough. Um, we got this uh, basketball thing, which is a hoop, which I didn't... Uh, I made it so that was upwards instead. Cause I, didn't, I figured that we didn't need uh, this one blocking the view. I didn't add the other basketball hoops or the basketball lines because I didn't think that they were important. Um, now we're going to go check out the this room. So we have a... Uh, this is like where they have one of the stage lights. I've been up here during uh, homecoming when they had the projector. I didn't add the projector or the uh, the screen because uh, I didn't think it was important. It kind of blocked the view. But I was up here when they played the senior homecoming video uh, for Pacer Palooza. Is that what it is? Something. It was no. It was some kind of homecoming thing. Um, you know the big uh, uh, light. Uh, we got some storage. I know that there's storage up here. I know that there's a ladder that goes up here. And there's a bunch of mats. Why is this up like that? There we go. 
got mats up here. Um, I have actually been in this room, uh, which it's some kind of boiler room thing, but you come through here and then you're in the weight room. Now I'm going to go back around and we're going to go through the weight room through the gym. Now I do want to say I haven't been in the weight room since freshman year. Uh, oh, we have Miss Bar's room. Yeah, Miss Bar's room. Ugh, nuts. Okay. There we go. Alright, uh, we got this room locked. I've never been in there. Just know there's like blue lockers or something in there. You go up these stairs, which I thought these stairs were like just uncannily accurate. Um, very narrow. Like I said, I haven't been in here in a long time. I know last time I was in here, there's a big mirror over here. Some mirrors over there or whatnot. I know that this juts out that way a little bit more. It's really dark over there. Um,. I have seen, no actually no I have been up here, I was up here for, uh, when the homecoming thing was going on, because I came over here to talk to Shay Rushlow, who is working on manning the other light that's usually projecting from right here over this way. Oh yeah, so we have this little, we have the other stage, or not stage, uh, the other door that's hanging there. So now the reason why there's a bunch of chests in here is because my sister told me that's a basically a storage room. So I was like, oh, fine. I just made it into like a storage room thing. Um, never actually been this far over. I just thought there's a bunch of garbage, in, or not garbage, but just whatever up here. Um, uh, scoreboard, I guess. Uh, we got this room. I don't really know what's in there. We have Mr. Abbott's room. Oh, whoa, hold up. What? Okay. Didn't know that wasn't finished. Uh, anyways, we have this back door. Oh. Come on. Don't do that. Alright, we're gonna go to the other room first. So, I think this is intro to psychology right now. But it was also career readiness uh, first semester this year we got this little storage room we have this back room that leads to the other side so now we're going to go back <laughs> I should have planned this out better okay yeah I definitely should have made a map of this when I was taking a tour so now we have like one of my favorite rooms in the building this is the uh, woods room um, or workshop uh, ah, what what room is this? This is like trades. I know it's construction trades. I think it's blueprint reading. Um, woods and small engines. Yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. Um, I think that's all that's in here. But like Mr. Musgrave, who's retiring, uh, sat right there. Mr. Zombie would be in here occasionally. This is that stupid desk with all the pencils that Mr. Musgrave uh, yells at you about. We got a table saw. We just got some working stuff going on over here. We got Mr. Zondig's little chest of uh, goodies. Uh, I don't know what's inside this room, so I didn't make it. Um, we got a little door that leads up to the stage. Over here, we have the piano room. Because I know that some people like play piano in there. I'm pretty sure it's much much closer to that door because I can, I could hear them playing when we were, like a uh, building and whatnot. Got the storage room again. Uh, we're back in here. Uh, this I don't know why this is blocked off. Something out here? No, there's nothing out here. I don't know why it's blocked off. It's weird. Okay. Um. I think that's it. Is there anything I forgot to show you? Um. Hmm. I believe that's all. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's about all. We didn't really get to go out here and look around. Well, this is what this kind of looks like. Um, 
I guess we can just take a quick tour of the outside. So we got this big Shoreland logo on here so that when it was on the big mega map at spawn, you could see that. Which I can show you guys. We have the big roof. If I when I get further into making this map, there will be a, an entire road that goes back over to here, which is a neighborhood area. Um couldn't add the parking lot, obviously. Made it too close to the uh curb. We got the choir room. Oh, okay, so not everything on the outside's finished. <laughs> um, oh, okay. Um, I just got the outside, I guess. Mm, that's obviously not supposed to be there. Uh, that's supposed to be the STEM room, I guess, so. And we just have the big empty space, which is where the boys' locker room would be. This is would be the entire boys' locker room, more than likely. Yeah, this would literally be the, this entire space here would be the boys' locker room. Um, and Mr. Abbott's room, for whatever reason, I didn't make. I don't know why. What the heck? Why are there just holes everywhere? No, we got this window here as well. It's weird that there's a bunch of holes. Oh yeah, as you can see, this overlapped over the edge of the uh, island. <laughs> you can still see that the, that the border is still there. Um, got the stage. Um, so, now that you've seen most of the school, we are going to quick go back and look at the map. So you've now toured this entire school. We are right here where you see the little crosshair is. We're about like right here on the map. So now we're going to go see what this looks like on the mega map. Oh, whoops. my frame rate's already dropping. So these are all the other buildings. And as you can see, the Shortland Lutheran building is the biggest building in this map. <laughs> and it's ridiculous. I should have just made an entirely different world when I built the when I built the school. But this world was lacking a school and now it has one. So that's an upside. So I hope to all the Shoreland students watching this that you enjoyed watching this. I hope to share this with the Shoreland faculty however that I haven't because I don't want them to be like oh so this is why you have poor grades because you're building in Minecraft. It's not. <laughs> I'm just it's hard for me. I don't know. Don't worry about that. Um, oh there goes that. Um, I hope you enjoyed looking around here. Uh, I'm gonna share this with the faculty at the end of the school year probably. Um, hopefully I can finish the music video um, for all the seniors graduating this year. Um, I hope this was uh, refreshing and I hope for all of the Shoreland students here I brought a lot of nostalgia uh, or some sort of really good feeling to see the school again, whether it was in Minecraft or not. Um, and uh, I hope you all have a great day. And uh, I re really miss you guys, including the teachers. Um, I miss all of you. Thank you for watching my video. Uh, again, I hope you enjoyed. Like, share, and subscribe if you'd like. <laughs> uh, still YouTube, still gonna try to get subscribers. Um, hopefully I can do something like this again in the future. Give me a little bit of support if you'd like to see the music video created uh, and finished. Or if you're interested in seeing how far the music video has gotten. Thank you. See ya.